we just left Confusion Hill and we're on our way to the Avenue of the Giants. If you want to see about Confusion Hill, go to the previous video. We're back on 101 and 1 and we're heading north. And there's a few sites on our right here. That's the old 101 and 1 down there. This is just a bridge. And we're going over a bridge and we're going to do some things. And here's where it catches back up right here. But we'll catch you some more sights as we go and we're going to do some stopping. All right. We are coming into Benbow. See what is up with this little community. Then we're on our way to the Avenue of the Giants. We just left Confusion Hill. Oh, this is where Nancy wants to stop. She wants to see this one log house. So I'm going to go ahead and take a break here for a minute and get this set up for you. Alrighty, folks. We're out here at the one log house. We are about five miles north of um, north of Confusion Hill. There's the log house. We're going to go look around. Nancy's got some things she wants to see in here. Nancy has paid for us to go in to see this one log house. Let's we'll see what it's all about. Crafted in 1946 from a 21 year old redwood, this section of the tree weighs, 4 .2, weighs 42 tons and took 8 months of labor to hollow out a room 7 foot high, 32 feet long, with wheels attached it toured the US in its early years then settled in the Redwood country arriving here in 1999 just like a home inside is furnished with living and dining areas pay a dollar a person Did you put a couple quarters in there alright this is pretty neat I just got whacked <laughs> hey our trailer's not this big Kind of what I was thinking. You want to get around me or? Oh, it don't make no difference to me. Pretty neat. Pretty neat. We're on the other side now. Wow. Couple of beds. Little table. Full kitchen. It's enough to live in. Absolutely. This also is over here at the one log house. Bunch of cut up pieces of redwood already for sale for somebody. If they got things they want to make like tables and things, they look great. Nancy wants to go see this grandfather tree. We're walking over here to this grandfather tree. They have more carvings out here. Here's what Nancy's wanting to go see is this grandfather tree. Boy, it really goes way up there. Pretty close to this grandfather tree. It's a big one. Says that the grandfather tree ages 1,800 years. Its height is 265 feet. You know what you got to do when somebody says something a height of? Of course, you got to do this. That's a big tree, and it's 24 feet in diameter. Well, I don't want to run around it. teepee here is pretty neat, all carved up out of a tree or something, or maybe 
it's just scrap wood, but it's still pretty cool. Here's another sight along the side of the road here. It's kind of neat. We're about another two or three miles north of the last stop, probably about five miles north of Confusion Hill. And they got all these chainsaw carvings out here on the side of the road. Pretty neat stuff. All right, we're traveling along. We're again, we're on the 101 and the 1 freeway, traveling towards the Avenue of the Giants. We're actually already in the Redwoods, but we want to actually take the uh, scenic alternative or alternate road and drive actually through the trees and all the stuff. Getting ready to go over another bridge here. Maybe there'll be some scenery off one direction or another. Doesn't look like it this time. All right, we made it to our destination. Avenue of the Giants in the Redwood Forest. We have 31 miles of scenery and just some of the most beautiful picture places that anybody could ever get. So we're gonna move on down this road and see what we get. And an auto tour pamphlet back there. Do you want it? No. side of the road. Strange sights. Yeah. That was different. Every once in a while where they put the road they had to carve down the side of the tree. Here's one. Because you get just a little bit too close to the root system. traveling through the Avenue of the Giants. We've just left Myers Flat. I don't know where what the next little town is that we're going to run into up here, but I'll give you a few minutes of the video for those of you that either have not gotten to the Redwood Forest here in California and the Avenue of the Giants. Or for those of you that have and would just like to remember it.
yesterday we saw a van that had you know basically ran off the road and got stuck up to his axles that was up the road about 10 or 15 miles from where we are now but it was quite a sight Nancy and I were just commenting on the idea that the road's extremely hard because you just kind of want to pass out as you drive it and the um, light coming through the trees almost causes um, an os oscillation effect your eyelids want to bounce up and down mine want to bounce down and stay down but it's pretty dense redwood forest here lots and lots of trees Nancy was telling me earlier that some of these trees are as old as our modern day calendar starting at year zero that's pretty doggone old for a tree and of course they're extremely tall you get out and you look up in one of these trees and you just look up all the way up into the sky Eel River Visitor Center. In Burlington Campground. need smell a vision people have campfires going you need to smell that word that wood burning okay we just left the Avenue of the Giants we only drove about halfway through it um, gorgeous pictures now we're on our way back to Eureka maybe some other communities along the way we hope you enjoyed our videos